Hi guys, welcome everyone. Happy Black Friday. Yay! Oh my gosh, look at my kitty in the sink right now. That's Sarah. You're so in trouble. Sarah, get right now. Right now. Get down. Get down. <sighs> she listens to me, obviously. <laughs> Hello everyone, happy Black Friday. Who knows who has been out shopping? I've been out shopping. I've been very frugal though, very frugal. So I kept my word on that. But guys, if you are new to my channel or if you're tuning in from my decor side or my jewelry side, this is my um, jewelry channel and my dad's a gemologist but tonight I have some door busters that I want to blow out you know because like I'm a retail store or something <laughs> and um, I have some great deals um, I'll wait till a few more people are on here I just sent an email it is late night but we're gonna do this we've got door busters to give a well not give almost giving away because they're so inexpensive. I've been running around town all day. Kind of look like a mess today. But I have on such a pretty ring that I got. It's one of my favorite for right now. And I didn't put my other favorite one on. Um, I, I had it on and took it off. But um, I should, now I don't know where I put it. <laughs> Anyways, I've got busters and I'm so excited. I did get a door buster today. I only was able to get one, but that was okay. Because sometimes door busters aren't that great, you know, at the store. But I definitely wanted two of them. And I got one of them. And then I got some just great deal. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. I got two two door busters and then, oh, I guess I got a few more. Okay, well, I'm happy about it, but I wanna share with you my door busters, what I have, and um, I'm super excited. So if you're on here, I see there's five people, please say hello. Hi, Anna, how are you? Um, I see I got my own notice, well, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> Anna, did you go Black Friday shopping? I did. I did, but I didn't overdo it. I stayed totally within my means. Never. I didn't leave until like later in the afternoon because I had a bunch of stuff I had to get done. I had to run errands and then I went Black Friday shopping. And normally, you know, I'm not really into the Black Friday items because there's they're usually electronical or electronic or housewares and I have everything, but um, both my dad and I need rice cookers. I couldn't get that one. But I did get myself a new coffee pot for $10 and I'll give it to my dad to give to me for Christmas. <laughs> because I need it. I have a five cup one and it's not cutting it. And it was the same price, $10. But, and then I got just a bunch of random, uh, I can't say cause my dad will, is on here. Um, well, well, he'll be on here, but I got some things like from my dad and my brother-in-law and my sister little things, but each of us are only going to get one main gift. And then um, my nephew, same thing, one main gift, a small gift for him and stocking stuffer. So I'm super excited. And um, yeah, I'm, I did good today. I think I really did good today. <laughs> Hold on. Let me post this to my Facebook. I think I did anyways. Okay, I think I did. Anyways, but I have um, some really beautiful things that are so inexpensive. Sometimes we need a few gifts that we don't want to spend a ton of money. And 
but we have multiple people to buy for. And it's funny because my brother-in-law said last night, he said, yeah, I really love that cream you got me last year. He, he said, I still have it. I've been savoring it. And I said, it's at, at the Dollar Tree. I told you. <laughs> It was one of his stocking stuffers, and he loves it. He says it works great for his eczema. And I was like, oh, my gosh, I'm so happy. I go, well, I'll buy you more. It'll go in your stocking stuffer. But sometimes you just never know what's really going to be a hit. And I bought, I think my dad, brother-in-law, and tenant, Brian, each um, a flannel shirt that were from uh, – Target like three years ago, I think, and they each love them. They each wear it still. And then last year I bought them fleece flannel looking zip up jackets for $20. They both love them, my dad and my brother-in-law, and they still wear them. And I thought, oh, they both had them on last night. I thought, <laughs> that's I didn't know they were going to be a hit. So hi, Francis. How are you? And it turned out to be a great hit. And then, um, so this year I'll show on, on my other channel what I'll be doing for my family. Um, it'll be a lot of homemade gifts, you know, like fudge, um, baskets of things that they can take up to the mountains because they go the next day into the mountains and they have a cabin and they meet up with their family and they go skiing and all that. So I, I prep them a big basket for that day and it's always fun. I'm super good. I've been running around all day. That's why my hair, I pulled it. I pulled, well, I have most of it's pinned up here and then the rest is in a clip, but the weather has been great today. And then, um, Good weather, lots of high energy in the area, and then, uh, I don't know, everyone's out shopping, so that's why I'm here so late. <laughs> but <laughs> anyways, I thought I would do it here, and then I, if it doesn't, if I have issues with the streaming, I'll go to my main channel, but it's late. All right, Sarah, you can't get up here, okay? So, guys, I'm just going to start because really right now all I have are doorbusters, inexpensive items that are $5, $10, and one $20 item. So, the first item, and my friend made these, um, but I do have um, the extra ones in case you like them, different colors. I had a really nice Thanksgiving. I overate. Oh my gosh. We all overate. And then I ate things that were not agreeing with my stomach. I had a lot of dairy. So I had a little tiny bit of eggnog, my favorite. Then I had real whipped cream that my brother in law made. And I had cheese, like uh, deli cheeses, like, you know, nice cheeses, like a white cheddar, um, smoked gouda, that kind of thing. And then I had one more thing. What was it? What was it? Oh, it's cheat. Um, no, wait. No, there was one more thing. And I thought, no wonder my stomach is just, it was not good this morning. That's for sure. <laughs> Hi, Shana. How are you? Oh, my gosh. Look at her. Stop. Sarah is like on my back. How are you, Gianna? You're up late. <laughs> Hey, you're supposed to call me. I told you to call me. <laughs> um, and so my stomach was not good last night and today. And that's why I got a little bit of a late start. But nonetheless, I got I got some doorbuster deals. And I'm here to offer you some too. So look at, look at this. Look at who Sarah. Look at her. Sarah, I, really, I don't want your bum in my face, and they don't want it in their face either. So get get down, get down. All right, we're just going to start. So I have some earrings that are $5. 
Oh, it's okay. I don't want to bother you because I know there's a lot going on there. But when you're ready and you want to, you can or want it to call me, call me. And there's no pressure. I just don't want you to think I didn't call you because um, I I know you're. There's a lot going on there. And so whenever you have time. All right. So I have some earrings here. And these are the $5 earrings that are the door busters. Now, they will be on a card, and they will have, like, a, um, a plastic sheath over them, you know. So these are great, guys, for stocking stuffers, your coworkers, your nieces, your – hi, Kim. How are you? <laughs> um, your – Friends, girlfriends, maybe neighbors that you're close with, you know. Anyways, I had a friend make these. She's really, she's so quick and she does things so nicely. I, I like what she does. And I didn't know she did this until recently. Um, now, these are ceramic, what I'm about to show you. They're turtles and owls. Um. Now, I, she gave me extras to show me, show you all, because I wasn't sure how many to buy from her because, <clears throat> excuse me, I didn't know, if, you know, if um, what you all would like, but I have a variety. And they're so cute, though. Um, okay, so I'm going to show you. Okay, so the first one... Um, these are on hypoallergenic shepherd's hooks, and they are ceramic little green turtles with, I guess, seed beads above it. And they're little ceramic turtles. Aren't they so cute? And they're glazed, fire glazed. Aren't they cute? Okay, so it, they come in that color. She gave me extras just to show you guys because I just wanted to buy so many. It comes in the lighter green. Um, they're like a, they're a light green, not a mint green. Okay. A light blue. <laughs> so cute. I love turtles, by the way. <laughs> These are ceramic. Um, that dark blue, which I love. And I guess this is like an oatmeal color cream. Okay. So these are going to be $5. And she can make multiples. And they are $5. Little cute ceramic earrings and they come on the card and then also they'll be in a plastic sheath so if you like this kind of thing you like turtles um they're five dollars and i have the different colors like i just showed you aren't they so cute that's the dark green i'll show you um let's see maybe they let me show it against the card. Here's the oatmeal color. The light green. These are great for stocking stuffers and they're hypoallergenic hooks. And the dark blue. Ah, uh, do I have turquoise blue color? I do. And they're in how light. And she did give me those um, to show you guys as a sample. Let me grab it. Hold on. Did I not bring it? No, I guess I didn't bring it. Let me let me grab it. And I've got this water too. I came prepared today, tonight. Yes. 
Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oop. Okay. Now I had a little, um, oh, it was like a little charm that I had sold and it was like one of, kind of like this one. These are in Howlite. I know, look how cute. Okay, so there's either turquoise colored Howlite or the ceramic ones and they are $5 and they are hypoallergenic. And then, of course, the Howlite ones that I just showed you. She gave me a little sample for all of them. That was really cute. I'll give them back to her, though. Um, then I have, these are ceramic and glass bead um, owls. And they're also on hypoallergenic um, shepherd's hooks. It, they kind of roll because they're on a on a flat card, but they are round, <laughs> chubby little owls. Oop, they're moving. There we go. And they are ceramic in the dark blue and white. Here's the back. Isn't that cute? Okay, and then she gave me um, the other color that she has, which is this lighter blue than the darker blue. Oh, look how cute they're, little chubby ones. So that's the light blue, and then this is the dark blue. So these are the color difference. Hi, Diane. So those or those, light blue or dark blue. And they are ceramic. Hi, Diane. Hi, Lynn. <laughs> I look a little haggard today because I've been running around for Black Friday, getting a little bit of shopping done for myself. <clears throat> which I, I got stuff done. So those are $5, guys. And they are adorable, chubby little ceramic and glass earrings. And cute little owls. Those are five. Next one. Hi, Roberta. How are you, Roberta? I'm wearing your ring. It's my new favorite new ring. I love it. I wore it all day today, all day yesterday. And my I had like this hand looked like this yesterday. And then I had my amber rings on this hand. The one that my I bought myself and one that Vanessa and Francis bought me. And um, my sister said, oh, well, don't you look kind of cool? <laughs> and I said, I do. She goes, yeah, your rings look really good. And then I had like little silver hoops, you know, and so I, I thought that was a nice compliment. Um, I had a really good Thanksgiving, really good food. Um, my sister and I really ate a lot of vegetarian and so did my dad and then my nephew and brother-in-law ate the turkey but um my sister made really good dishes i was very impressed i couldn't believe it <sighs> oh i love it roberta i love it look at look how gorgeous that is and it's so big and chunky it's totally in my style isn't that pretty I love it, love it, love it, love it. <laughs> so I'm going to show the little tortoises again. They're $5. These are the other door buster. They're ceramic. They are on hypoallergenic uh, shepherd's hook. And they come on a card like this. 
And these are like a darker green. And then they have a plastic sheath over them. And they come in the other colors. Sorry, guys. I'm just showing these colors again. Hi, Cricket. How are you? They come in the lighter green. And they're ceramic. They come in the lighter blue. Ceramic. And the darker blue. Look how cute. And those are all $5, including the owls, the ceramic owls. You do, Diane? Oh, they're so cute. I need to buy some from her, too, for me. But I thought these were such great little stocking stuffers for $5. They're ceramic owls. And then these are the lighter ones. She gave me... Um, a sample to show you guys. That's the light blue. Oh, and brown, how cute. She didn't have brown, but these are cute. Now, I also have, she gave me a sample of, um, these are, oh, did I not grab them all? <clears throat> Oh, I'm sorry. And it came in like an oatmeal color. And those are ceramic. Then, one dark blue. Okay. Thank you so much. I had them. <laughs> okay, Francis. So you want the dark green pair of green turtles got it one dark blue owl got it okay thank you so much they are so cute and these are the halite ones and they are turquoise color they're really cute um They're like a turquoise colored halite. So those are $5. Then I got to write this down. Hold on. Sorry, guys. Uh, let me grab paper. I kind of forgot. <laughs> I don't know how I forgot, but I forgot. <laughs> All right, sorry. Okay. Thank you, Francis. Let's see. Francis. Green. Ceramic. Turtle. There is. And dark. Blue. Ceramic owl. Okay. Thank you so much. Hi Jennifer, how are you? Oh, can I, I I'm not tired because I've been I have been going all day on little sleep, but it's been a fun, somewhat a fun day. Um, let's see, am I missing anyone? Uh, Thank you, Francis. Okay. Oops. Oh, there we go. Okay. So the next ones are the turtles I showed you in the howlite and the ceramic and the owls I showed you in the dark blue and the light blue. They're so cute. Oh, you thought you were going to go to sleep, huh? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. These next ones are 
Um, these are abalone done in a fire glaze, and they're so beautiful. Um, they're very like peacockish color. Um, the shepherd's hook is in sterling silver, and um, these are gorgeous. So the shepherd's hook is sterling silver, and then, of course, the abalone. Hi, Jeannie. Look at these. How beautiful. These are $10. And I don't know if you could see them. There, there we go. They're abalone. And they've got a fire glaze on them. And these are $10. Look how thick they are. I'm going to show you the back side. Aren't they beautiful? And they are $10. They're kind of long. Not long, but, you know, they're great for the price. They are approximately, because all the different shells are a little different, about, about two inches. They're $10. Thank you, Jennifer. Now, I have multiples of these. So I have multiples of the turtles, the owls, the abalone, because my friend made them. So... Uh, let's see, Jennifer wants one, and then Francis. Okay, thank you so much, guys. And they are very thick. Look at, well made, look at that. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. Um, it's from Mexico, this one. It's like a hammered. I love it, too. Thanks, guys. <laughs> All right. So, oops. They are really beautiful. Super pretty. That's a great stocking stuffer. So let me write that down before I forget. Francis. Abalone. Sterling. Earring. And then... Oops, Jennifer. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, 26 days until Christmas. Oh my goodness. I got a lot of shopping done today, so I feel pretty good now. I'm always stuck on my nephew because it's Christmas and then his birthday the day after. It's a tough one. <laughs> I know. I don't want to know either. Okay. Um, if you didn't like those longer abalone ones, they do come in the shorter one. So she sent me home with these. Oh, I have had the Christmas music going since, oh my gosh, probably two weeks ago. So there's these. they got the fire glaze on them. Aren't they beautiful? Oh, it's his birthday on the 30th. These are nicely made. So these will also be $10, this color or this teardrop. And, oops, there's one more color. Thank you. Buy a mall around dinner time. I know. I have been in craziness all day long. I haven't talked to anyone. These are aqua. I don't know if you can see the color. 
These are pretty. I really like these. Let me just hold up one. Let me get closer. Oops. This is, sorry, this is what she sent me home with. They're very thick abalone, but this is the aqua color. And these are $10 in the sterling silver shepherd's hook. I just took them because I needed to show you guys something. So there's the kind of like more the natural color abalone. Uh -oh. And then the aqua. Hopefully you can see the color difference. So this is like more of a grayish and that's more aqua. <laughs> Let's see, hardest part is having three family members born on Christmas day and trying to give a gift that is, oh I know, oh my gosh, that is hard. Three, oh Lord have mercy. It's hard enough with my nephew. He, he does an Amazon wish list, which he showed me last night, and I think I'll get him what he wants. It's uh, it's not extravagant. It's like a, a clock, alarm, nightlight. <laughs> it's so silly, but he wants it, so I'm like, okay. <laughs> All right, so in the aqua, these are also $5, and the shepherd's hooks are 5 or sterling silver. And then in the other teardrop, they're the more natural color with the sterling silver um, shepherd's hook, also $5. Okay. Next thing, and I'll show you some more earrings in a second, but I'm going to switch gears a little bit. So I did a bunch of tins because you know how when you go to the store and you buy those little gift baskets or, or boxes, you know, and I often, they're, they're okay, but um, this is geared more toward, it's like a little, little more what I would like. And I think with the broad, maybe, uh, spectrum would like. <laughs> um, and it's got a little bit of everything. Now, if you want to buy one for a man, let me know. But this one has a little of everything. It's a tin. Now, I have multiples of these. Right now, I have 10 of them. They are different sizes and shapes and adorable. A few, quite a few of them are in gingerbread house shape. Um, this one says have a cup of cheer and has gingerbread. And this is the size. Isn't that cute? I, wish, I love gingerbread because I do my kitchen in gingerbread. And by the way, everyone in my neighborhood has already done their lights outside. I'm like always the last to do it. I, I'm like, it's just the day after Thanksgiving. <laughs> so these are really cute tins. So I have this one here. And let me show you what's inside. It is not jewelry related. Uh oh. So we have a candle. We have a gingerbread house. We have an ornament, a new ornament. We have fuzzy socks. We have a new lip gloss right here. Which, by the way, and I searched and searched and searched, these are not tested on animals. Very important to me, and they come in various colors. So you can kind of tell me, like, oh, I like pinks, I like nudes, I like maroon, I like red, whatever. You can 
tell me and I'll put that in there. There are some, oops, Hershey Kisses in here. They're caramel and then the cocoa ones. A little bit of chocolate. And then um, this one has cinnamon tea, four bags of cinnamon tea. Now every, every box is a little bit, look how cute this ornament is, by the way. It's, they're all new ornaments. Letters to Santa. You put it in the mailbox. Isn't that cute? <laughs> every box is a little bit different, but every box will have a candle, the gingerbread house, the lip gloss, an ornament. The ornaments will be different. The candles will be different. And, oops, if I, and the socks will probably be about the same, either black or, you know, I, I chose like black or red fuzzy socks. Um, if you don't want tea, you want more chocolate, just say so. But they're really cute. This is in a glass container and it's a nice candle. This one is, um, oh, it smells like winter frost or something. Really nice. <laughs> Do you want this one, Francis? So, guys, these are only $10. Hi, Lydia. If you are interested, $10. And it has a little bit of everything. The gingerbread houses, the candle, candies, tea, ornament, socks, and the new... Lip glosses, you just have to tell me what color area that you like range. $10. Now they're all different sizes, but they're all really cute. <laughs> you want seven of them? Okay, Gianna, no problem. Look how cute. So they're all a little different, all different sizes. Let me write this down. Um, Francis, did you really want that particular one? Let me know. Let's see. We'll write Francis. I'm going to call it one gift box. Okay. And then Gianna wants seven. Gianna, seven. Thank you so much, Gianna. Thank you so much, Francis. Thank you. They, they were so fun to put together. They really were. Um, hi, Sandy. <laughs> okay, so... Um, Gianna, you're going to have to tell me um, what color range of lip glosses you want. I have reds in the oranges, nudes, um, you know, reds, that kind of browns. I have, oh, they're so nice. I, I tried them on. I tried one on today. I'm keeping for myself. It's a color I would never use, but I love it. And they're not tested on animals. Super important to me. I'm so glad I found them. And I didn't want to put anything as a cookie in here that had any palm oil. So this does not have palm oil, the little gingerbread house. That's important to me too. And if you wonder why, I'm not going to preach about it, but Google it. It affects orangutans. Even when they say that they're supposed to abide by the, uh, the, um, the laws, they don't. Definitely, Francis. Okay, light colors and all for Gianna. Let me write that down. Light colors. Got it. Thank you so much. And the candles will be different. So they're all, but I made sure they were all very fragrant and nice. Pink for Francis. Got it. Thank you. Sarah, seriously. 
Uh, Cricket, they are ten dollars. And um, yes. Oh my gosh, Lynn, are you kidding me? I don't want to preach, but look up the um, palm oil or palm kernel industry and what happens. You can look it up on on YouTube. It's so sad. I won't talk about it, but that's why I make sure I don't buy anything with palm oil. And it's good for us, but they just happen to take it. Come here, buddy. My tenant's coming down to do laundry, I think. Sorry, Ibrahim. You need to do laundry? Oh, okay. Shh. <laughs> He's such a pill, huh? Okay. Okay, so you want me to put the, the earrings inside. Okay, I will definitely do that, Francis. Um anyways, they there are some that are okay, so I have one that's a twenty dollar one because I only have a tin that's big enough. And it's this one. So it definitely holds more. So in this one, you're gonna get everything that I just showed to you but the ornaments are going to be different they're going to be just different if i feel like the ornament is a little smaller then i might add another lip gloss if or whatever you know but um like this one's going to have a bigger soap like a bigger soap that i make in it um it's going to have a piece of jewelry it's going to have more chocolate and i mean it's a bigger tin so you can see the difference i can fit in more But I only have one so far, and um, so I can personalize that to whomever. <laughs> That's so great, Gianna. I'm so glad. Gianna, do you want black fuzzy socks, or do you want red fuzzy socks? And there were other colors, but I kind of like the the basic colors, you know, all black or all red. And they are so comfortable. Lori is comfortable. Yeah. Well, here's my baby. He doesn't think there's anything wrong with him. Mm -hmm, baby. You oh good looking baby. Oh, you've got kibble breath. You do. You've got kibble breath. Oh, baby. Yeah. Yes. Look look how gorgeous he is, you guys. I love my baby. Baby, baby, baby. Look at him. He's so... <laughs> His yawns are so funny. I love you, baby. You're my baby doll. Okay, get down, Stinky. Get down, Stinky. No, you can't get in my sweatshirt. Not right now. Okay, black socks for Francis. Okay. Uh, pink and then black. Cut it. And then uh, Gianna said mix it up. I think I saw that. Where did I see it? Mix it up. Okay, got it. Mix it up. Got it. Thank you. Thank you so much. They're so fun. And I don't know. It's all practical stuff. Us ladies like candles. We like ornaments. We like lip glosses. We like gingerbread houses that are good to eat. Candy. Tea. <laughs> Hi, Becky. How are you? <laughs> He's so my baby. Isn't it baby? Um, baby, say hello. Can you say hello? Can you hear him moan? He, he's such a moaner. Baby, what happened? What happened? What happened? Mm. <laughs> okay, so I have um, multiples of those made up. I just have, and I'm sorry, you guys, I haven't sent out so many packages because I've been waiting on making some um, 
more soaps and I've kind of altered the stocking stuffers so that they all have kind of like a soap and jewelry and they're more evenly distributed. But I only have the one in the $20 tin and that's going to have more. And I'll, I'll pack it pretty good. So then it'll have jewelry. Okay. So that was that. Um, the gift boxes, which I, I thought were so fun to do. And I had so much fun putting them together. A golden one, the sporting group at the Philadelphia Dig Show, but didn't win best in show. Are you talking about my doggy? My doggy? <laughs> he would never win anything except annoying. <laughs> Okay, so guys, um, the other, I have odds and ends to show you, but um, like I said, the earrings were the doorbuster. Um, tomorrow I will show you what I'm going to be showing you tomorrow. Um, I'll just show you guys some of them again since there's some new people on here. These are ceramic owls. Now, there were other owls that I think there was one other owl that she gave me. They're on hypoallergenic posts. These are five, and they're a little chubby royal blue owls. They come in the lighter blue. She gave me a little sample to show. And then they're turtles, ceramic turtles. I love turtles. <laughs> they're one of my favorite animals. These are the green ceramic ones. Then they came in a light green. It's kind of hard to see the color, actually. An oatmeal color. A light blue. And the dark blue in ceramic. Those are all five. And then the abalone. Um, they come in sterling silver shepherd's hook hooks, and these are 10, and look how beautiful they are. They're fire glazed. They are on sterling silver shepherd's hook. Here's the back. Look how thick. Look how nice they are. These are 10. I don't know if you can see the color. They're beautiful. Oh, let's see. What about shipping? Shipping is normal. Um, weight, you know, uh, according to weight. So that's always been the same for me. Um, the show was a couple of weeks ago, but they broadcasted on Thanksgiving and last night. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, buddies, he hears my little buddy. <laughs> That's so cute. He wants me to hold him all the time. You know, he wants us to get inside my sweatshirt. I mean, it's like that all day long. <laughs> I feel like a kangaroo. <laughs> oh, thank you, Becky. Oh, my gosh. I really hurt them. I mean, I really did a number on them, but thank you. I need to cut them or file them and then maybe put clear coat on them. But thank you. <laughs> he wants his mama. I know. You guys, they are always on me. On the little nugget is when we sleep, she's under my armpit. Then the puppy is... I don't know. He could be in various places. And then, lucky, she doesn't like to be on the bed. So she's down below in her bed with, like, three th uh, throws on top of her. <laughs> uh, 
a kangaroo baby. He kind of looks like a kangaroo too. Come here, come here, come on, come here, Munchiki. Come here, baby. Come on, Musia. Oh, doesn't he look like a little king? He can jump like a kangaroo too. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, my sister, she never saw me until yesterday. And she's like, what happened to your face? And it was like, this is better. I mean, it's just like that. It's a little, little more puffy on this side. And it's still swollen right in here. But, um, and it's, you can kind of see the swelling right here. It's still a little sore, but nothing like it was. I know, he's my little marsupial. Mm, my baby, my baby. Mm, mm, mm. Look at him. Isn't he pathetic? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I fell, Becky. It was so ridiculous. I'm so klutzy. And I, I caught my feet on the um, doggy gate right here in my kitchen to family room. And I fell, I face planted hard onto um, this mirrored side table. And oh, what a mess. So I, I was kind of, it hurt really, it hurt initially, but then, you know, the swelling went down and it was fine. Nothing, I didn't, I can't believe I broke the mirror table, but I didn't get cut. I had scrapes, but that was it and bruising, that's all. And um, my, this finger got extended like too far this way and it's still a little swollen, but it's fine. Because at first I thought, oh, I broke it. And I thought my teeth came through my lip. It didn't. I can't believe it after that fall. I can't believe how lucky. I'm, oh my God, I'm so lucky. So lucky. It's awful. <laughs> I got scared. I was like, nobody's out. What if I died? <laughs> I almost passed out because it was pretty, the pain initially was pretty hard. And I thought, I'm going to, I'm going to pass out. And I'm like, nope, 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 don't pass out. I was like fanning my face and I didn't pass out. I was fine. I know. I really thought they came through my lip. I know. I know. And then three weeks before that, I fell in glass into a glass frame. Didn't get a cut. No cuts on my jeans. Nothing. I can't believe it. I was telling my sister and my dad last night. Like how lucky I've been. So I need to like slow it down a little bit. Not always be in a rush. <laughs> it was scary. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, nobody's here to like, I thought I was bleeding everywhere. I, I wasn't bleeding, but it was pretty hard. You know, in the movies where you see people slam people's heads on a table and then they get up kind of stunned, but they keep fighting. You can't do that. That's ridiculous. No way. I mean, that's pretty intense, you know, but that's what it felt like. Excuse me. It was fine, though. I mean, I was it was fine. It was I was totally fine. Look at this gorgeous, look at this gorgeous baby right here. All right, so the other things, oops, that I want to show you. Let me, uh, she gave me samples of some other things. So basically all the gift boxes, um, they come in different shapes and forms. Some of them are in the house shape. So I'll mix it up for you, Gianna and Francis. Um, and they are so cute. And every ornament will be kind of different, of course. Oh, I grew up Catholic, Adam. I know what that's about. Um, and it's nothing against Catholic religion. I grew up that way with just Catholic school and everything. It's just I'm not Catholic anymore. But I do revert sometimes to those ways. Like if I can't find something, I pray to St. Anthony. Help me find my eight car keys. <laughs> 
<laughs> because I do believe in saints. I do believe that they can help you. I really do. All right. Let me, um, let me grab, um, what was it was? Oh yeah. Hold on. Let me grab the other earrings. I'm going to show you. Hold on. <clears throat> All right. The only other earrings that I, uh, the beads that she gave me to show you guys were these. Um, they're the other owls. So let me compare them. One is bigger than the other. It's like a little bit bigger. Oh, they're almost, a, they're almost the same exact size. So I showed you these that come in the light blue and dark blue. But these are all white with the dark blue accent. And these will also be on the surgical steel, or I'm sorry, hypoallergenic. So she has those, and those will be $5. And all the abalone will be 10 because they'll be on sterling um, ear hooks. So the aqua ones and the other color ones will be 10. Um, and they'll all come on a card like that in plastic. And if you want me to wrap it, let me know. Oh, I always pray to St. Anthony and I always find my stuff. And I always um, pray to St. Francis for the animals. Um, okay, so I have those. Those are my door busters for tonight. And then I have this sterling silver ring. I'm just going to show you kind of random things tonight. <clears throat> I'll, I'll show you fashion and it's um, random randomness. This ring is a size. Seven and a half, exactly. Uh, it's sterling silver. Let me put it on. It reminds me of a wedding ring. This is not brand new, but in excellent shape. And this has um, topaz in it. This is gonna be a steal of a deal. This, I would lo have loved a wedding ring like this. It's so funny because when you're looking for something, you can't find it. So there are topaz on the in, um, I think they're prong set. They look prong set. And then they have the smaller ones and then the main one in the middle. Isn't that pretty? This one's going to be $63. $63. If anyone's interested, it's like the perfect, <laughs> I mean, you don't have to wear it as a wedding ring, of course. I would wear this normally. Hmm. 
Isn't it beautiful? Thank you. Okay. Then, um, I'm going to show you something very different. Now, this is coming up for the holidays. Guys, I've had this for a very long time. This is not jewelry. It's a collar. So you, I don't know, back in the 60s, I know these were very popular. I wore these um, back in, oh, I don't know, probably my early 20s. Um, they're very, like, fancy. It's kind of a, you put it around the whatever you're wearing, just to kind of make it look a little more fancy. So it's like a folk fur collar. Isn't that cute? And you could do a pretty bow. I've never used it, but I did buy it. I actually love these. And it just dresses up whatever outfit, you know, coat you might have that doesn't have like a collar or a sweater or whatever you want to dress up. These are awesome. And it is by Style Theo, T or yeah, T H I O. And it's one size fits all. This is five dollars. I'm just trying to put out like some Christmas ideas out there. And uh, these are so, so cute. These have come back. So it's a collar, and you tie it around whatever you're wearing. So that's five dollars. And sorry. I have some other fashion jewelry. Let me go grab it. Or is it here? No, I gotta go grab it. Okay. Let me show this again. Because I think this is gorgeous. <laughs> this is um, natural stone and blistered pearls. Um, it is... It's an 18 inch, I believe, just under an 18 inch. <clears throat> and like I said, it's all natural stone, hand carved beads. And then it has blistered um, pearls. Oop, there's a dog here. <laughs> This one is 20 if you guys are interested and it has very peacock colors. So you can see the blues, the purples, and then the blister pearls are that, you know, peacock coloring. Isn't that beautiful? $20 on that one. It's so beautiful. Look at he's trying to get look at he's trying to get inside of my jacket. Look at that. Ready? Not right now. Okay. Go in your blanket. Go in your blanket. All right, get in. He has to be inside my jacket all the time. Ridiculous what I go through. <laughs> Anyways, $20. It's a great Christmas gift. It's all hand carved beads, stones, and then the blistered pearls, which are beautiful. Let me show you up close. I'm sorry, I can't get that, get that close because he's inside. Buddy, can you? Uh, all right. 
Oh, and it had a 14 karat gold clasp. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. Oop. 14 karat gold clasp. It's a nice clasp, too. Buddy, I can't even move when you're here. <sighs> You'll never change. Okay. I have these little cute bracelets. They're enamel and uh, gold tone in red and cream chevron. These are $3 for the pair. And if you, you know, they look cute together, actually. This is a great stocking stuffer also. I don't know about you guys. I try to look for stocking stuffers like $5 and under. And, you know, they're hard to find. Buddy, you're like really, you're really in my way now. You're going to have to come out because I can't get close enough to the camera. Okay, baby? I'm sorry. A little later, okay? A little later. <laughs> All right. Then, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, where did I put it? Okay, so I'm gonna do some dollar items here in a second. And I'm gonna do some very inexpensive items. Also could be for um, stocking stuffers. Now these are light pink freshwater pearl stretchy bracelet. This is going to be $5. If no one gets this, I think I might have to keep it. I don't know if you can see the color, but they are blush pink, very light pink. $5 for freshwater pearls. They're like a light pink. <laughs> Aretha on my head. Okay. These pearls, I can't go too much lower on this because they have a sterling silver um, clasp. And so this will be $20. And they are potato pearls with a sterling, these are older, sterling silver clasp. Careful, buddy. You okay? You okay? Now these are white and these are 20 for real pearls and sterling silver fitting. And it's very thick silver. Okay. All right, let me grab some of my silver stuff. So one second. Okay, Jeannie. All right, guys, so <clears throat> for any purchase that's made tonight and going forward, it is going to be the payment has to be made within 24 hours because um, I've had too many issues with people not paying on time, taking a month, months to pay, and I can't do that. You know, I can't hold stuff forever, and um, I see people buying, the same people buying on all the other sites, and so please be mindful of that. I see that people buy 
on all the other sites. And I'm sure um, that not everyone's waiting a month, two months, three months for whatever reason that's given. So please make sure that you pay within 24 hours. Anyone that purchases from tonight on, um, because I can't hold things for very long. Um, and I think all of us sellers on YouTube probably have that issue. <laughs> but at some point, you know, we all have to crack down because we all know that people are out there buying and then not paying. So I have to say it tonight because there's so many. And it's like, I depend on it. I I take care of my dad. I'm not working November, December, and January, almost all of January. So I depend on the money, the sales that I make. So please make sure if you say you want it, please make sure that you are able to pay for it because it's a disappointment for me. I'm telling my dad, oh, I sold this much tonight, but then it doesn't come through. So um, I do appreciate if you all can do that. Um, let's see, very pretty, let's see, pretty colors or pretty value. Ah, yes. And, you know, I think a lot of us, you know, um, we all consider each other like friends. And unless they say, hey, you have 48 hours or you can pay at this date, that's different, you know. And, um, but when people say, oh, it's a oversight or I've moved or I've had some issues, I totally get it. But just let me know so I can release the items and show them again. Um, let's see. How, how long are they? Okay. So, Jeannie, the pearl necklace is... Um, 16 inches because you know here's the thing too guys we aren't blind we see everyone in the chat we go from one room to another and when people tell us oh I can't pay but they're buying a ton of stuff elsewhere I'm pretty sure they're not telling everyone that so just because I'm nice doesn't mean I can't get paid I have to <laughs> It's become an issue now, so I have to say it. I'm not working right now for the next three months or two months now, um, so I have to get paid within 24 hours. Um, and as far as shipping goes, I will also make sure I ship right away. But there's uh, Gianna. I haven't shipped yours because I that one howlite piece had to get reglazed, so I've been holding it for that reason. But um, other, other than that, and Kim, I had to alter your stockings <laughs> because I wanted, you like the soap. I wanted soap to be in, like, you know, most of them. Uh, yeah, so 18, what did I say? 16 inch, so collar length. And um, sterling silver clasp. So... Uh, let's see, Jeannie. Did you still want it, Jeannie? They are the potato pearls. And sterling silver. Okay, let me know. All right, let me go grab the other silver real quick, guys. Um, let's see. Well, that's too long. Okay, we'll pass in. No, I have not, um, Diane. Mm -mm. Mm. No, I have not. Are you talking about the pendants? No. Um, it is... I forgot. Oh my goodness. It is 
<laughs> 16 inch. Uh, 16 inch. Becky. They are potato pearls. And this part is sterling silver. It's thick. That's a nice gift for somebody. For $20, yeah. Pearls. I love getting like fine jewelry. I love getting anything from fashion jewelry, fine jewelry. I don't know, I like it all, you know? I like everything. Anything is a gift. Um, I liked. I like getting almond roca or ornaments for Christmas. You name it. I like just a gesture of Christmas. You know, I like getting a card. You know, <laughs> so I'm not big on the the price of things, but I do. I love the spirit of Christmas and giving a little something for like stocking stuffers. I love just doing stocking stuffers and like a main gift. And it's because I, it's not because I'm thinking of Santa Claus. I'm thinking of the celebration of the birth of the Lord, you know, but you know, it's a little pagan, but it's so much fun and festive. And I just love it. Let's see. I have had so much fun finding pretty, I know, huh, Becky? I've had so much fun putting together these tins. I'm telling you, just like the stockings, it's so much fun. And they they were just, I don't know. I had a great time. This was a lot of fun putting this together. It was just, I don't know. I'm so in the Christmas spirit this year. I'm having such a great time. Um, let me go grab some silver. I'm going to use the restroom really quick, guys, because I've been drinking, um, well, a little bit of carbonated water, some regular water. I will be right back. I mean, how can you not love Christmas? Even if I was by myself, I think I would still, I don't know, I still love Christmas. You know, even when things were hard after losing my mom, I still love Christmas. Okay, I got to zip this up. I'm kind of cold. I'll be right back. Um, let me bring back the silver. Hold on, guys. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, let's see here. <clears throat> Hold on, guys. Just grab me. 
Oh, here it is. Okay. <laughs> this is, I feel like a big, fluffy, fuzzy <laughs> person wearing this. I love school earrings, Lori, they, that you put in the sand has. Oh, good. Weren't they so cute? And I think that was soda light. It was so either sodalite or jasper, the stone above the little squirrel. Um. <laughs> yeah, I'm fluent in typos, exactly. Okay, so let me grab this. So tomorrow I've got some different things to show you guys, but tonight... I want to show you this stuff. Oh, oh, buddy, you can't jump up here like that. You're going to hurt yourself. You're going to get hurt. Sorry, guys. There we go. Okay. I have a coral ring. Buddy, you cannot be up in my... Seriously. Come on, buddy. You gotta get down. I'm sorry. You go in your blankets, okay? And I'm telling you, it's like this all day long. All day long with him. If I'm home. Poor thing. I feel so bad, though. Oh. Okay, this is a size, <clears throat> I love this ring. It's a size seven and it's um, old coral and sterling silver. Now, I can't remember if this was hallmarked or not. Anyways, no, it's not, but it is um, old, and it's coral, set in sterling silver. It's a size 7. It has been reduced to 75. If you are interested, it is 75, and it is old coral. Coral. I don't know why I'm saying it so weird tonight. I think because, <laughs> you know, normally on Black Friday, guys, I actually, I eat, I like to eat junk food, but not tonight. <laughs> Kim, I do that all, like last night I kept falling asleep. <laughs> oh my God. I was so embarrassed and my sister fell asleep. Like she was snoring so loud and my dad and I, and I were looking at each other like, <laughs> we were watching Hallmark movies, Christmas movies. Oh, my gosh. It was hilarious. We all fell asleep. It was hilarious. So this one's 75. Isn't that beautiful? This is, like, clean. It's an old vintage piece, but it's, like, modern. That's what I like about it. Modern and clean. Kind of like this one that I got from Sweet Roberta. And I just love it to death. I got a lot of compliments on it today, too, by the way. So 75 on that one. Uh, I loved everything. The beautiful necklace and this. Oh, I'm so glad. Wasn't that beautiful, that pendant? That was a great deal. I'm so glad you liked it, and I'm so glad it went to you because I I really love Swiss topaz. It's that really pretty different blue, and I like sky blue topaz, but Swiss blue has that little bit of a different blue to it, which I like. Yeah. Thank you. 
Okay, size, what did I say? Seven? That was a size seven, if anyone's interested. Oop. Gosh, what did I do? Yeah, size seven, 75. Seven, 75. <laughs> it's big, too. I don't want to push it all the way down. I'm afraid. Come here, little girl. Oh, I'm so glad, Diane. I hope your daughter likes hers. And your daughter got an eyeshadow that's made by Wet n Wild, and it is not, uh, it's uh, cruelty free, not tested on animals. So I only included things like that. For everyone, um, it, would, it had to be cruelty free, which is like I said, the new lip glosses that I'm including in the boxes. This is a pretty pink. You can't see how pink it is, but it's a pretty pink. And they're really nice, really nice, cruelty free. That Santa has adorable too. She is going to love that. You did an awesome. Oh, thank you, Diane. And like I said, you can put your cutlery in them. And um, I'm so sorry, Kim. I haven't got yours out because I wanted to tweak yours a little more because you like the soaps and I wanted to incorporate that in them. And I've been behind in my soap making. <laughs> but no excuse. They'll go out. They'll definitely go out. Let's see. Tomorrow, Sunday. They'll go out Monday. And all of them will go out Monday. Because you need to get them out to your friends and coworkers, so I apologize, but you okay, girl? She's so old, poor baby. I just want to make it, make sure everything's like done just right, you know. And sometimes the detail, I get caught up in the detail, but I want to make sure you enjoy it all and that you appreciate it and like it and you, you know, you can really use it and not just like, Oh, I only like that. You know, <laughs> I want you all to enjoy everything I've sent you, you know, whether it's the tins, the Santa hats, whatever, the goodie bags I did. Okay. So let's, let's show a little more silver. Uh, oh, here we go. Okay. This one. Oh, thank you, Diane. I hope your daughter likes it. I really do. Um, when I was a teenager or preteen, whatever, I would have liked that eyeshadow. I wouldn't have worn it in front of my parents, but I, I would have worn it to school somehow. I would have snuck it in. I used to put makeup on at school and then take it off because I... I don't think I was allowed to wear makeup. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Um, this is a Navajo piece. It's signed AT and it is sterling. Um, it has really gorgeous embossing on the sides. I'm showing this again. Um, it is a coral piece in the center with the, um, it's like the, the, I think it's called the six star. Um, there's six points to the star here on each. There's four of them. And it's very thick silver. It's very heavy. Oop, sorry. This one has been reduced to 75 if anyone's interested. And it is signed AT. Right there. Oh, right there. You can see it. Really good. Yay. <laughs> and it says sterling. 75 on that one. Very thick. If you want to weigh it, I will. Um, well, I don't want to bend it, but it fits me. I was wearing this one all day today. My little cat, <laughs> my cat, porcelain cat, little, oops, and crystal. These are glass, Austrian, or sorry, glass, uh, Austrian crystals. And I 
I got so many compliments on this darn bracelet. Isn't it so cute, little kitties? Because uh, <laughs> I had a lot of pink on today. <laughs> um, so it fits me nicely up here. And which these should fit like right up here, in my opinion. Now you can bend it open. I don't want to bend it. But you can. It's a nice cuff. I don't want to bend it open more unless someone, you know, whomever wants it and they want to open it up a little bit, then they can do that. But this one's 75. It has been reduced. And it has the six point stars, four of them, around the bezel and then the braid, which is nice. And all of the, uh, I call them crescent, half moon embossing, oxidized silver. And AT is the hallmark. That was 75. <coughs> These next earrings are uh, Mystic Topaz. And they are set in um, rose gold. And they have the earring backs, and then they have uh, little rubbers on the back if you prefer those. I just put them on the card. They are like brand new, but they are not brand new, but they are, I don't think they were ever worn. But they are Mystic Topaz. In rose gold. So, oh, buddy. I swear, he cannot be up here. So, nice long post. And in my opinion, that's a plus because, um, look at, look at, he's trying to, look at, look at, he's trying to get inside. Look at you guys. Isn't that? <laughs> I can't help but laugh. Oh my gosh, this is too much. Oh, hold on, buddy. You're like stuck. Oh, fine. And then he like turns around. Look at he turns around like I'm some. <laughs> oh my gosh. Buddy, that doesn't feel too great. <laughs> Get your butt in there. There we go. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> He's too much, you guys. It's kind of embarrassing. But this is what I go through all day long. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. So, <laughs> this is the uh, nice long post. And they have the rose gold little end pieces. I mean, that's important, you know. And... <laughs> <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. Oh my god. Look at now he's like all fine. He's he's fine. <laughs> I look all misshapen. <laughs> look at it's like <laughs> oh my god, that's so ridiculous. Um Mystic Topaz. The story on the Mystic Topaz is really nice. It's a husband and wife story. Um, <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. These are going to be, these have been reduced. They are, like, brand new. Uh, let's see. Maybe you can't see them. The coloring. Look how pretty. In rose gold. <laughs> these have been reduced. To $45. $45. You can't buy that on, <coughs> excuse me, QVC. Um, what's the other one? HS, I think HSN. Macy's. You can't buy that for that cheap. In fact, my dad was like, do these, do people, <coughs> do they see the prices like at Macy's and the fine jewelry stores? I bet if they did, 
they wouldn't realize the jewelry is a great deal. <laughs> and I said, well, I don't, I don't, <coughs> you know, it's, it's hard to, uh, people on YouTube don't normally shop outside of YouTube, which is kind of true, right? We kind of don't in a way. Anyways, these are 45. <coughs> Excuse me. But these would go for a lot more. Especially Mystic Topaz. Okay. Okay, I'm going to show, I know, I mean, you know, now that I've gotten out of retail, when I worked retail, I, I shopped retail, I don't shop retail anymore, I shop all online, my groceries, everything, I mean, I get my vegetation, like my fruits and vegetables at a local store, but after that, I mean, like, you know, uh, paper towels and such. It all comes from, like, Walmart online. Um, yeah, so, I mean. Oh, I can't. Sorry, you guys. My dad wrote on here. All right. This is um, for any of you who like gold. It's 18 karat <coughs> gold plated and a red, well, it's called like a fire zircon. And it's really beautiful. Sorry, I left the, his tags on here. Because sometimes he'll put tags. And it's beautiful. This ring is, oops, it is, uh, oh, it, okay. So it's a six and three quarters. I know it is too peopley out there. Oh my gosh! T today was just—it was so crazy, crazy. But it, it was fun too at the same time. I was by myself. My friend uh, Tamika couldn't come; she got hurt. So I need to check in on her a little later. But um, this is eighteen karat uh, gold plated. And it looks like it's electroplated. Really beautiful ring. And then it has a fire zircon in it, which is nice. Not a CZ, zircon. Six and three quarters. Oop, wrong way. A lot of embossing on the band. And the base of the ring around the bezel, it's or prong set, it's prong set, faceted um, zircon, fire zircon. Look how pretty, look at the cut of the stone. That's probably the beautiful, most beautiful part. Can you see that? It look <laughs> in, in a way, it looks like jello. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, this one is only going to be $40, and it is 18 karat gold uh, plated, and it is a fire zircon. Oh, it kind of does, Becky, actually. It's prong set zircon. Zircons are nice 
hard stone. So it goes diamond, the replacement for diamond is zircon, then white topaz. But, of course, this is a, a, a different color zircon. <laughs> Um, beautiful, 18 karat plated, electro plated. Prong set fire zircon. How many people like this ring? I just want to know. Because if, if not very many people like it, I'm going to... I'm probably going to create an Etsy store, but I want to know, but in particular to this ring, how many people like this ring? If you could just give me like a yes. Okay. So three people, four people. Four people, five people. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I'm going to do this one auction. You know how I don't like to do auction, you guys. Oh, my goodness. I don't like doing auction. I get so nervous. Sandy. Okay, Sandy, you like it too. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to do this in auction style. You know, I don't like to do auction, but I'm going to do it. Because it is Black Friday, and I kind of have fun with auction, too. So, <laughs> so I'm going to start this off at $20. Hi, Doris. Hi, Doris. I haven't seen you in a while. How are you? $20 on the Fire Zircon. Not to be mistaken for Cubic Zirconia. I think a lot of people think... It's cubic zirconia. Zircons are the replacement for diamond, then the white, then the topaz. It's a six and three quarters. Six and three quarters. It is a fire zircon. Look at that big stone. And if it doesn't sell, it's okay. I'm really thinking of doing an Etsy store for my. Uh, higher price items. Yes, start $20. Thank you, Jana. <laughs> Look at, looks like jello. <laughs> like in a jello mold that you poured upside down. It's just beautiful, really. And zircons are very hard. Like a diamond. They're the diamond replacement. So it's very nice, um, nicely faceted. The cuts underneath are really nice. So you get a lot of shimmer and fire. I'm so glad you're here, Doris. So I'm kind of using this ring as like a little test to see um, where things are with certain things. Yeah, any takers at <laughs> 20. I just need like a gauge of what people are interested in. It's 18 karat uh, electroplated. Which is like ionized, it will rub off. So it's not plated. Well, it is technically plated, but it's ionized. Electroplated is ionized, like a water treatment in plating. Eighteen karat. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I really want feedback because I will be starting an Etsy store. And I want to know what's going to sell on YouTube. What's going to sell maybe better on Etsy? You know, it's important to know. Yeah, it's too small for me too. <laughs> I do like gold. 
it's funny. I go through phases. I like gold. I like to hoard it for sure. But I like to wear it on and off. Um, my skin tone really takes gold nicely. So, but it's hard to say, you know. Sometimes in the mood for silver, gold, fashion jewelry. All right, we're going to pass on this, but it's good to know what will sell and what won't sell. I know, I know, Becky. It's so sad. I know. <clears throat> okay, so I'm thinking more of my gold will go in my Etsy shop. So that's really good to know. That's really valuable um, marketing info <laughs> I'm getting from you guys. So thank you so much. Okay. Next thing. Okay, this is a Mother of Pearl Art Deco Navajo ring. Um, oh, this is the ring, I think um, Gianna said it was the husband and wife duo team. It's like FY. So Frank and Louise Yazi, I think. That's what you said. I remember Yazi for sure. Um, it is a size... Five and three quarters, and it is like a very Art Deco-y, um, thank you, <laughs> that helps a lot, very Art Deco style to it. So it has a split band, but the sides leading up to the base is very Art Deco. Mother Pearl. Sawtooth, Art Deco, made by Frank and Louise Yazi. And this one's going to be $58 if anyone's interested. $58. It's got that very Art Deco. Uh, pyramid on the side. Oh, it's so pretty. Really love that sawtooth. Oh, look at all the wrinkles. <laughs> all my fingers. I'm so dry, you guys. So dry. <laughs> oh my gosh. At night, I try to. I if I remember, I try to put coconut oil. <laughs> I know. So you know what? There. I know. I agree. And there is a company or a, a few distributors out there that are putting out sawtooth um, settings. For new jewelry. And it's like, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Very rare though. And I love it. I love that they're bringing it back a little bit. So it's unique. And I love Sawtooth. Okay. <clears throat> now these are 10 carat. Um, earrings and they have CZs in them. And why? Huh. I don't know why there's a different back on them. Anyways, they are CZs. I just noticed one of the backings is a little bit different, I think. 
Yeah, okay. So one of the backs is a little different. Um, but it is 10 a carat. So just know that one of the backings are... Good night, Lydia. Are you going to bed? Have a good night. Um, so these are, uh, what did I say? 10 carat post earrings. They have CZs in them. They almost look like white topaz, but they are CZs. And the, there's only one back that matches because I noticed that the other backing is, um, I think it's sterling. So it's different. Well, I can put plastic backings on them, but, um, so just know that this only has one matching backing to them. Okay. So they are 10 karat gold with CZs. Um, these are going to be 15 if you are interested. Really pretty CZs in them. And they are 10 karat gold. So if you're a gold person, this is great. But only one back. The other one was in silver. So I'm going to include um, the plastic backings. But that's what they are. 10 karat CZs. Their prong set. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to put them back on the card. What did you guys all buy for Black Friday? I'm curious. Did you guys get <laughs> stocking stuffers? Electronics? I should have got a new laptop, but I, I didn't want to. I'll wait till next year. I'll buy maybe another one next year. Um, what did you guys buy? I want to know. I had fun today, even though I was by myself. But I still have fun. I really did. Hold on, guys. Let me put this away. Okay, these next ones are... I almost went to seize candies today, too. I, I just wanted to get a few truffles to put in stockings, and I thought, no, it's too soon. Or, you know, too it's too far away from Christmas to do that yet. Oh, <laughs> well, that's, <laughs> that's good kind of shopping. Because, you know, Black Friday is kind of geared towards, like, the door busters are geared towards, like, uh, you know, cookware and electronics. And then you got um, Monday that's, like, uh, Tech Monday. What's it called? Um, I can't remember. Whatever. Monday. Um, but... You know, if I didn't need certain things, I would not have gone out today, but I did. And I needed a rice cooker for my dad, for myself, and a coffee maker because the one I have is only five cups, and I need at least a 12 cup. I like to make it ahead of time. So I'm going to give it to my dad to give to me. It was $10. Ridiculous. And it's programmable. You can program it. Great, great deal. The rice cooker were ten dollars. So I'm, it's on sale till tomorrow. So I'm going to try to hit another location. I went to two locations tonight to get it. No luck. I'll go tomorrow to a different location 
And hopefully I can get at least one for my dad. <laughs> I know. I, and you know, I got this beautiful necklace from my dad. Oh, I hope he doesn't hear that. But from Cindy Jewelry Nurse. And I know he's going to love it. And um, I bought my sister a bunch of stuff. I don't want to say now because she does watch some of my videos. So I kind of stopped talking about it. I know my, my Jennifer, my dad or my brother-in-law's father has fibromyalgia and he, He's, it's funny because he's such a go-getter, but sometimes, like, um, he'll have a flare and he's down, you know. And But, my God, the stuff that he does, I mean, he is, like, a, he goes out and cleans. And, I mean, I'm so amazed, you know. Regular people who have no issues don't do as much as he does. And I thought, wow. But when he's down for the count, he's down. But then he rests, and then he can get back to his old self. So it's all about your mindset, you know. But we all, you know, people who have any kind of illness have flares. Lupus, fibromyalgia, um, what's the other one? Shingles. Oh, gosh. I, they're all awful, all awful. And I pray for all of you who have to experience anything like that. But, God, it's awful. Oh, God, Jennifer, I wish your daughter lived near me. Do you know how much furniture I have that I'm selling? Artwork. Decor. I'm selling it for like five dollars. I just want to get rid of it. I mean, people have been coming and buying, you know, multiple. It's really about not making the money anymore. I just want to get rid of it because I've created the catio in the garage, my my cats. And um, oh my god. Like I wish she lived near me. <laughs> Oh, congratulations to your your um, your daughter, though. Yeah, when you try to do, I know, I know it. My mom, same thing. She would get shingles, like flaring up. It, oh, it's awful, 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 awful. Yeah, three days. Oh gosh, shingles is longer. Lupus is longer. I'm so glad it's only three days, though, because that's long enough. It does zap you of energy. I know. I know. I wish you guys lived close to me because I have sold so much stuff for so cheap. So cheap. Decor. Vases. Artwork. Um, armchairs, armless chairs that are like, you know, accent chairs, uh, dining tables, um, you name it. I mean, uh, dinnerware, you name it. I've sold it. <laughs> okay, Becky. Yeah. <laughs> Call me. Let me know what you're looking for. <laughs> oh, God, Jennifer, that's terrible. Shingles is awful. And, you know, it only goes on, you know, half. And I remember my mom got it, you know, on her half, but it was like in her eye, her inside of her mouth, and then her side of the face. And then it started to go into her, like, her hairline and then her ear. Oh, it's awful. But she, she, you could 
spread it. And she did because she would like touch it and we put the ointment on it. Um, and then she would like, she had Alzheimer's. So, but we put the ointment that you could put in your eye so that if she touched this and touched her eye, it wouldn't hurt her. Oh my God. It, she kept reinfecting herself. It lasted forever. And then, Oh, it's horrible. Horrible. The inside of her mouth. And can you imagine in your eye? I can't imagine that. That's got to be horrible. Oh, that's oh, it's too bad, Jennifer, cuz I have so much area rugs, artwork, vase tall vases, tall Metal ones, ceramic, you name it. Oh, Jennifer, that's terrible. When did that happen, Jennifer? The shingles, I mean. Yeah, it does. It does affect your ear and your face, or your, yeah, everything. Ear, nose, eyes. <laughs> Oh, in August. Yeah, that's terrible. Terrible. It takes a long time to clear up, too. You, you have to get the shingle um, vaccination, but you have to be completely cleared of shingles before you can get it. Because it can be, uh, I think, deadly if you, if you aren't and you get the, the injection. No, I'm not moving, Doris. I have a staging business, and so I sell a lot of my staging items. Um, oh, you know, after so long, if I've used it and I can't use it anymore, but, but it's all in excellent condition. And, I mean, especially the artwork and decor, I have so much, so much. And, um, but yeah, I, I sometimes I would, would like to label it like moving sale because if I say I'm a stager, people don't realize sometimes what a stager is. <laughs> um, so it's sometimes better just to say I'm moving and then they come and they buy a bunch of artwork and decor. So, yeah, but they... Um, I mean, I have so much decor, so much. I mean, I'm cheaper than Salvation Army. <laughs> oh, Gianna, did your sister-in-law move out? Wait, did she move out already? That was quick. Yeah, Jennifer, you can catch if you can catch the shingles quickly. It's like um, it's along the lines of chicken pox, herpes, um, oh, uh, Hashimoto's. No, is it called Hashimoto's? I think Hashimoto's. I think that's what it's called. If you can ca catch any of that quickly or right in the onset you can shorten the lifespan, basically. I know, Doris. Oh, my Doris. You would flip out if you saw everything that I had. A lot of it's in my kitchen or the dining area. I have a little bit in my family room. And then all of my living room is filled with artwork, and decor, uh, a few dining tables in there, accent chairs, armless uh, sofa set from Z Gallery. I have so much, so much. I wish you guys loved clothes. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I know, Francis. I need to get that. I need to get the uh, vaccination. Because I do not want shingles.
Sorry, I'm reading the comments. Um, she should be here in two weeks. Greg and I promise to help her get back on her feet. Wait. Gianna, are you talking about um, Maddie? I thought Maddie was with you. Is Maddie still with you? Or are you talking about a different sister? Um... Gosh, I wish you guys lived close to me, really. <laughs> I mean, in a youth style, so it can be from, like, modern to, like, a pottery barn. It's really diverse. All right. <sighs> Sorry. Oh, my gosh. Do I wish I had pizza right now? But I have <laughs> so many leftovers which are so amazing in my fridge. Uh, it's foods I don't normally eat, which is really good because I... Uh... Oh, okay. Wow, that was quick, Gianna. That's really great. Wow, she really... She's really grown. Like, um, she moved in, she got a job, and she's moving out. And Greg is, oh my gosh, if you said you were coming, I'd be like, ah, I need to clean my house. <laughs> but no, I know you get it. Uh, yeah, oh, so much stuff, you guys. Oh, I wish I could find a puppy for you by then. Not a puppy, a dog buddy's age. Yeah. Yeah, because, oh, wait a minute. Gianna, you would have to come over the summit. There's been a lot of snow, but that was the last storm. It's probably clearing out right now, but there was a bad storm over the summit because Gianna lives in Nevada. I live in Canada or California, Canada, and you have to go over the summit to get to me. And, but I'm sure it's clearing up because it was a really bad storm, really bad storm. You, I think you're only supposed to take the vaccination once, Doris, but don't quote me on it. Um, I haven't even taken it yet. I need to take it because I have had chicken pox. So is my dad. He got the vaccination, thank God. And we, my mom kept having reoccurrence of shingles, so we could never give her the vaccination. Oh, really, Gianna? Ooh, we, it was, oh my gosh, it was so windy and so raining here, cold, cold. The rain was cold. And um, so I brought all the animals inside and, um, uh, man, it was cold, really cold. And then also, um, oh my gosh, the poor little animals. <laughs> Uh, um, they all got inside, but the feral cats are outside, but, um, anyways, um, what happened here? It was really cold. I mean, it was like 66 degrees inside my house. It was cold. So it was like a, a really good cold front. And then it's like gone. It was really nice today. Really nice. Sunny, semi-warm, like, um, I think it was like 65 out. Not bad. Not bad at all for winter. I guess it's te technically winter here. And, um, gosh, but the rain was horrible. And everything was blown everywhere. We, you know, here... Um, we have a lot of palm trees and on the palm trees, there's like this, uh, the, you know how they have like little, it's like little shells around the trunk. I call them shells. I don't know what the correct terminology is, but they're like these little brown shells. Like they're, um, kind of like a petal, but they're, they're part of the bark of the palm. Well, when they, when they grow up the, or when the trunk is growing up, 
they become shredded. And so we call them palm shreds. The palm shreds blow everywhere and they're chunks of palm. And you literally think there's like a dead animal in the road because it's like a chunk and it looks like an animal. <laughs> and I always stop. I'm like, oh my God, it's not an animal, but they're everywhere. And I'm constantly like looking on the road, <laughs> but they're everywhere and they get blown everywhere and they're a mess. They're such a mess. Anyways, they stress me out every year. Hi, Manji. How are you? The winds here shook my mobile home and almost sucked my... Oh, oh my gosh, Doris. That's scary. Oh, that is totally scary. That happened to another um, YouTuber. That was, Who was that? Frugal. She was talking about the winds and how crazy it was in her. And she lives in an RV. Manji, Lydia wants to eat. Lydia asked me about you want a free gift on her channel. Do you want Lydia to send it to me? And then I'll send your purchases all together like we did last time with Susan. Let me know. Hashimoto's, that's what it's called, Hashimoto's. Yeah, Jeannie, thank you. Yeah, Hashimoto's. It, oh, okay, so it's a thyroid um, disorder. Okay, good to know. I didn't know that part. Yeah, Hashimoto's. Okay, so Lydia, if you're still on here, <coughs> Manji said to go ahead and send her gift that she won on your channel to me, and I'll include it in her shipment when I send everything out for Manji. <laughs> that is scary, Doris. That's totally scary. Oh, my gosh. That's really scary. Well, I'm going to show you guys the same things, but before I do that, I got to show you the puppy again. Look how lumpy I look. It's not my fat. It's, it's the puppy. <laughs> look at baby. Oh, baby. Oh, oh, you're so tired. You're so tired, baby. Oh, <laughs> he's so tired. Okay, get back in. Get back in, baby. All right. Okay. So, oops. Oopsie. Sorry. Oh, she did. Okay. I'll let Lydia know. Thank you, Jana. I'll let Lydia know um, tomorrow then. Because, yeah. All right. So, I know he is comfortable. He's like my little kangaroo. Um, I know my little baby. He. His breath still smells like puppy breath sometimes. Not all the times. Not all times, but it does. It smells like a puppy breath. And then sometimes it smells like kibble. But um, I'm going to show. I'm just going to show some things again. I'm being repetitive because this is the night of doorbusters. I'll have to, more tomorrow. I just don't have everything tonight because I couldn't get everything coordinated from her. And it was my fault. Okay. So, Manji, Doris, or whomever wasn't here when I first started. These are ceramic owl beads necklace or um, earrings. They're so cute. These are chubby little owls. They are ceramic, hand painted. They are on surgical steel. Um, little shepherd's hook. These are five dollars. These are great stocking stuffers, and they're in the dark blue and the light blue. Here, are, oops. Here are the light blue. I keep 
throwing things everywhere. Oh my gosh. Good night, Gianna. Are you going to bed? Good night, Gianna. Call me tomorrow, Gianna. Because I, I, I haven't bothered you, but because I don't know, you know, just call me. I hate to bother people. Okay, then we have the ceramic turtles. They look like this. Here are the Hunter Green. They're $5. They are ceramic. Surgical steel um, shepherd's hook. These are hunter green, five dollars, but they come in the light blue. Cream, kind of an oatmeal color. Dark blue. And green. And then I have Howlite Turtles. These are also $5 for the earrings. And these are abalone and um, sterling silver shepherd's hook for 10 they're fire glazed they all come on a card and in the sheath of plastic and look how nice look how thick that abalone is They come in that Tur or light turquoise in teardrop and wait, that's a, yeah. And then um, a gray and they all have sterling. These have sterling silver shepherd's hook and they are 10. Let's see. Okay, Gianna, a green turtle and a dark blue owl. Okay, thank you, Jennifer. Let me write that down. Let's see. Oh, wait, dark green? Jennifer, did you want the dark green or the light green? Let me show you the difference. Dark green. These are like a light green. Light green. Okay. Light green. Buddy, you guys stop moving. Oh my gosh, look at him, you guys. <laughs> Look at his little paws. You're so cute, baby. <laughs> I love my baby. I love my baby. Get your paws in there. All right, Jennifer. Come on, baby. Let's see. Light green turtles. Thank you. And it was a dark blue owl. Dark blue owl. Thank you so much. He is so late. <laughs> Come on, buddy. You're like falling now. Oh, you're going to fall out of here. 
I look, I look so deformed. Oh, <laughs> look at me. I look like I'm 400 pounds. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. I love my baby though. I don't care. <laughs> okay. Um, I know. I feel so good about today because I we literally only give like one main gift and then stocking stuffers. And I feel like the stocking stuffers are the funnest part. And I'm halfway done. Halfway done for sure. Oh, Manji, you come here to California and you take them. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god okay so I showed you guys the turtles I showed you the owls oh one more owl these owls I forgot sorry they're white ceramic with navy blue that's the other owl <laughs> no way, Manji. I'm not giving him to you. <laughs> Jennifer, did you like these dark blue owls or these? I think you meant these, right? Which one did you like more? Let me know. The lighter one or whatever. Oh, let's see. The small shells aqua. Aqua. You like the aqua ones, Jeannie. These here? Okay. Thanks, Jennifer. These are the aqua, Jeannie. Are you talking about these? Thank you. If you and the, all the abalone, by the way, guys, it has sterling silver shepherd's hook. Yes, they are all pairs. So um, here's an example of the aqua. These are hard to hold. She just gave the, these to me to show you guys as a sample. Good night, Doris. Doris, check out my main decor channel because I have some DIYs coming up. I haven't done anything, you guys, but I've been caught up in the holidays and really enjoying them for once <laughs> in, a long, many, in many years. So I'm really enjoying them. Good night, Doris. Okay. And then, uh, Becky, I don't think you saw. I know. Isn't it great, Becky? I love it. Becky, these are the other, these are the tins. They're all different shapes and forms. They come with chocolates, a gingerbread house, lip gloss, oops, lip gloss, new lip gloss, an ornament, fuzzy socks, a nice candle. That's glass. That one's glass. Um, and some tea. I, you can't see it, but there's tea right there. Um, and it's um, either cinnamon, peppermint, or nutmeg tea. And they are ten dollars. They all come in different tins. So this is this one. Um, some of them are in the shape of houses, and they have, like, little roofs. <laughs> They're cute. 
but they will all be in one container. The only one that's different is this one. And it's because it's bigger and it's going to contain more stuff. And that one's going to be 20 because it's really big. And it'll have everything that you just saw. Oh, and the ornaments will be diverse. Also, the lip glosses are new and they are cruelty free. And I have a uh, an array of colors, so you just tell me like pinks, reds, nudes, browns, whatever. Um, but in here, it'll probably be a piece of jewelry, a bigger soap, um, which does not the soap doesn't come in those, and also um, like you know it'll be. A bigger ornament, something of that sort. But I only have a one twenty dollar one. So whomever wants the twenty dollar one, and if people want more of the twenty dollar one, I will do it. I just have to get more of the containers. But me too, Becky. I am enjoying for the first time in many years <clears throat> the holidays. You know, like yesterday was really nice. It was kind of stressful getting ready to leave. But I thought, you know what? I'll get there and we'll get it all done. And we did. We had a really nice dinner and we hung out all day. It was really nice. Very nice. Okay. Thank you, Jeannie. Have a good night. Yeah, I'm really enjoying each season and each holiday. Yeah, I really am. Oh, you know, I'm sorry, you guys. I haven't shown you all my jewelry. <laughs> I think I started talking about this one. Um, <laughs> so um, this is a 10 carat, six and a half size ring. It's all prong set. They are CZs and uh, 10 carat. Six and three quarters. Those are CZs, and they, it is 10 karat gold. It's a nice thick band. Okay, guys, this one's going to be a really great deal. It's real gold. It's CZs, and you know how much gold is nowadays. But this one's going to be 25 if anyone's interested. The CZs are all prong set. And it's a six and a half. <laughs> Good night, Jennifer. Have a good night. <laughs> I, don't, I can't believe I'm not tired right now. I really can't believe it. This is a pretty ring. Okay. Thank you. Um, Diane, okay. Light blue turtles. These are the light blue turtles. Okay, got them. And um, second little blue owls. Oh, the more white blue owls. These are cute. I l they look like beautiful pottery to me. These blue owls.
Okay. <laughs> Oop. Thank you. Okay, I, ha I have to write them differently because those are more white than any blue. Okay, so Diane, light, blue, turtles, and white. I'm just going to call them white and then blue um, owl. Earrings. Thank you. Thank you so much. Those are cute, huh? <laughs> I love that white and blue pottery ceramic. That's my favorite. My favorite. I have a lot of white and blue, especially in the um, patio. I love it. Okay. Thank you so much. Oh, you know, I think I forgot to show them. I'll have more to show you guys tomorrow, too. I mean, it was such a whirlwind today, and I thought I'm not going to have time to get it all together. But um, they do look like pottery. I know. Gosh, I love them. Look at these. They're just adorable. I have a big iguana like this in my patio. And then I have it's from Mexico, and I brought it back with me. I mean, it's huge, iguana. And then I have a big frog, but it has a little bit of a lime and yellow and red, a little bit. But the legs and face are all this white and blue, which is my favorite for Mexican pottery. Love it so much. Now I'm on the hunt for clay Mexican pottery that you can cook in. I've always loved the ones where you can put your water in and the, the cup over it. The water tastes so good when you drink out of that. But they have a glazed clay pottery that you can cook on the stove. And it's, it, it's just amazing. I need to get that. And it's so expensive here. So I need to go to like Mexico and get it and bring it back. Oh, they do look like my tea. Oh, you should see my teacups that I have that are white and blue. Hold on, I gotta show me to you guys. They are so pretty, and I got them for I think forty nine cents each, um, at Goodwill. Get that, baby. I have to show them to you guys. I mean, they were such the deal of a century. Okay, so these are Bombay, and they were, I think, a dollar nineteen, maybe. Not forty nine cents. That was something else. Look at, they're all different too, and they were a dollar nineteen. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> So I think I got six of them, and they're beautiful. I haven't done anything with them, but just display them. I haven't even washed them. Aren't they beautiful? I love blue and white pottery. Oh, my gosh. It's just my favorite. Anyways, um, they do look like the owl charms. Oh, my gosh. She had, like... Um, Owl, what are they called? Purse fobs. They were so cute too, but I didn't know if anyone liked those. So I guess if you do, let me know and I'll buy them from her because she is trying to make some money and she must buy it in bulk and then make them and I buy them from her and sell them. But these are like, I'm not making much profit on them, but it's more of like just a door buster, you know, but she had some cute stuff. So I wanted to get it. All right, guys, I showed a little bit. Of, oh, hold on. Let me show a couple more pieces. I wanted to show you guys tonight. What did I do with it? 
Here we go. This is a seven and a half. Oh, for my friend, she made them. Um, she made the little earrings, Diane. These, she made these earrings, and she made some necklaces. I'll show you guys tomorrow. Oh, look how cute and chubby they are. Yeah, so my friend made them. Um, <laughs> she's so sweet too. <laughs> um, okay, this is a seven and a half ring. It's a um, I think it's stainless. Yeah. Oh no, it's silver tone. But it's such a pretty, um, it reminds me of, um, what is that? Um, Coach or something? Gucci, maybe? But it's just a fashion ring. And it's really nice. This one's $8 if anyone's interested. And it has a bunch of... Um, I believe these are prong set. Yeah, these are all prong set, you guys. These are little Austrian crystals. Is that Coach or Gucci, like faux design? Because it's actually a silver tone. Isn't it pretty? What, baby? You want to come up here like always? All right, guys. <clears throat> I think I'm going to call it a night because it's getting super late. And um, I will have my different things to show you tomorrow. And I will have different door busters. I just showed you a few examples of what she had that I got from her. It is, it is like, yeah, it's like a G. So maybe like a faux Gucci or something. Um, but she has like some really pretty pieces. I think the abalone is my favorite. I mean, I just love abalone. So these abalone, and this is sterling up here. And then they come in a gray or turquoise color. Um... I'm so glad she gave me samples. And um, she. I'm so glad I got these from her because <laughs> they're fun. They're so much fun. And they do come on a card. I put them on a card and in a plastic sleeve. So they're great for, like, stocking stuffers. Five bucks. Hypoallergenic. Oh, thank you. Manji, did you want to get a pair? These are only $10, and they're abalone. Oh, one came off. They're abalone and the shepherd's, the hook is um, sterling. So that's the abalone. They're fire glazed. And look how thick the abalone is, guys. I have multiple pairs from her. And this part is sterling, the shepherd's hook. So if anyone wants them, they are only $10. Shh. $10. This is, I think, the steal of the night. Abalone and Sterling, $10. Okay, thank you, Manji. So, like I said before, you guys get your pick of the teardrop abalone in the gray. It's kind of hard to see, but it's the gray. And then here's the aqua. These are also 10 that's the aqua. And 
and there's sterling on the hook part. Thank you, Manji. They're not heavy. Nope, they are. I'm not going to put it in my ear, but they are not heavy at all. But they are so pretty. Well, you can't see. Okay, hold on. Let me put it on this side. They are so pretty, but they're not heavy. They're not like a, they're light, even though it's shell and you can see how well made they are. They're not heavy. Okay, so I got Manji down. Now she has multiples of those and the teardrops. So let me know if you guys want one or the other. They're all $10. Um, Manji, Abalone, and Sterling Earring. 10 bucks. That's a great deal. Where are you going to get Abalone and Sterling for $10? I mean... <laughs> And they do come on a card, so if you want to give them as a gift, they're a great gift. Um, okay, guys. I think I'm going to have to go to bed. I'm getting tired. They are so pretty. Look at that. Oh, I think I need to eat. <laughs> I need to eat. <laughs> look how these are really well made. They look like a real leaf. Okay, guys. So I showed you all these tonight, but I will show you them tomorrow, and I have more tomorrow to show you and necklaces that are are um door busters and that are really nice with pendants on them, natural stone pendants. And I will see you guys all tomorrow. Oh, I'll have more jewelry to show too. But um, tonight was just about the door busters, basically. So guys, I will see you tomorrow. Um, I hope I'm not bothering you too much by coming on twice on the weekend, but it is a holiday weekend. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Diane. I'm going to yawn again to make you guys yawn again. <sighs> they say if you see someone yawn, you can't help but yawn also. It's just a metaphysical thing that our body does. <laughs> Uh, if I could yawn again, I would make I would yawn again to make you guys yawn. All right, guys. <clears throat> Thank you, Diane. That's so nice. Good night, Sandy. Good night, Becky. The puppy's crying. <laughs> Good night, Manji. Francis. Diane. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm not sure who else is on here. But good night, you guys. Have a good night. I will see you all tomorrow. I'll be more prepared because I'm not doing Black Friday. <laughs> but all your packages will go out very soon, you guys. The stocking stuffers. I just had to alter them a little bit. All right, guys. Bye. Love you all. Look at it decorated my little tree. So it's green lights. Red beads and uh, candy canes from last year. I kept them. I mean, you know, they're good for ornaments, right? <laughs> Bye, guys. I can't wait to decorate. I have done very little decorating. And I have to do my ladder tree. I'm not going to do the big tree, but I'm going to do my ladder tree. Bye, everyone. Say goodbye, baby. Mm -hmm. Don't cry, baby. You're such a baby. Don't cry. I love you. Okay, don't cry. Don't cry, baby.
Don't cry, okay? Say goodbye. Everyone's going to go to bed, so you gotta say goodbye. You gotta say goodbye. Hi, baby. Look how cute he is. Oh my god, I love him. Oh, you cry like a baby. You cry like a baby. You cry like a little baby. I love my baby. Bye, bye, guys. Oh, my little darling, I love you. I love you. Are you hungry? You want a little snack before we go to bed? Well, I'll give you a snack. Get down. Oh my gosh.